Um, I just uh, played uh, with this journal uh, this morning. This is the latest journal I'm working in and um, I feel that the size and the previous energy of the um, pages um, suggest some new ways of working. So what I did, I uh, started doing is adding um, strange um, pieces, uh, strange pages into um, in the middle of old spreads so they will give uh, this spread uh, um, was like that uh, I felt it's uh, I want to change it so uh, one way to change things I need to do it better uh, uh, I just saw this morning um, going through my uh, stash is to bring in more uh, 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 diff new pages, uh, half work pages, um, thick pages. You see, I added this here. This was the original uh, spread. Um, it also, all these additions also make uh, make the um, the journal be more uh, more thick, more yummy. You see. So the texture is also um, suggesting some uh, new ways, uh, new discoveries. Um, let me show you how I do it. This was the first page I did yesterday. And then um, um, it, it gave me uh, a new inspiration to go back and work with it because it feels, at the moment, it feels very playful. I just enjoy flipping through it, enjoy touching it. Um, it's also a nice part part of the of the work. Uh, and now I will show you how I do it. This is um, this was an under uh, paper uh, that was in the on the desk on my table um, a while back, and. Um, I made a journal of it um, that uh, at some point I felt didn't work for me. So what I did this morning is took out took out some pages, um, and now I'm thinking, for example, adding this ear. Um, maybe because. Uh, this is very chaotic for me at the moment. There was time that this uh, kind of chaos helped me work, but at, at the moment um, I feel the need to cover it. But um, this kind of uh, pages um, sometimes are the, um, the kick to start working, so I feel the need to cover it and make something out of it. Um, so uh, I will glue this page here. Um, I think part of the decision was that uh, I saw this uh, um, uh, <laughs> and the color being connected. Okay, so what I do, I use, um, uh, let me see what color I have. Maybe I need another, some kind of, um, and there are a few ways I can use. Uh, I don't want to, it to be too harsh, so maybe I'll use this green. I need to pull out more. Um, I can use the neutral uh, masking tape, but many times <laughs> it gets lost in my mess here. Um, okay, this is one way uh, I can do it. Here too. One more, uh, one more way to connect them um, is to look um, for other papers in my stash, like this, for example, and glue it in the middle so it holds two pages. I love adding uh, old pages. Okay, 
So now I glue it here. This is um, a very interesting uh, way to um, like spreading the way some candies for you to uh, go back to. So um, I just um, while playing this morning and uh, uh, listening and watching uh, in the background the artistic um, videos. I many times I, I work and uh, and listening to other artists' voice in the background. I can add. Let's see. Okay, it's not it's not dry yet. Maybe I'll use the glue stick. Um, I can ha add here another, another washi maybe, or add another scrap of paper. Uh, sometimes what I do is taking parts um, from previous pages. Now this will not go out very nicely. So, um, okay, this this piece I took from here. All right, because this page um, is very thick. Um, that that can be a good reason to add it to this um, this, this journal that I'm falling in love with. <laughs> with each second, I'm playing with it. Um, I want to show you more one more example. I glued this um, pieces here. Um, because I liked uh, the, um, the the colors, the the design here, and how they match together, and I haven't noticed that the shape that it's here is mimicking this shape. So sometimes we do uh, we do things um, subconsciously, um, and it's part of the charm um, because when you walk back and look at it you see you see those things so um let me see okay this is need i want this picture i need to work on this to um to make a physical connection i don't like uh, pages being uh, torn up while i'm working on them so I need to glue this down. I just don't find my um, masking tape at the moment. Okay, let me show you one more example. I already, already added this here, so um, but this could be a nice, uh, nice match. We have the blue here. Um, I like what I see here. I think it was a part of previous page that I glued into this page. I love uh, I love uh, this image of girls. Um, let me see if I can find this. This I think would be too chaotic. Um, this is I tried uh, doing some. Um, abstract form abstract it's kind of it could be a painting this is already uh, disturbed the energy of what was here before i added um, pieces of thick paper no i like i like this combination so um, uh, let me see this is what uh, we did on the other day. Uh, yesterday I added this piece of paper here. Uh, it feels nice with this. And um, I think what I'm looking for, and I'm not so... Um, no, I don't want... I love this uh, spread. 
I like this spread very much, but this could uh, be a wonderful, um, you see, this could be a wonderful um, matching. So I, I will keep looking. Maybe I'll end up not using it. Um, the the um, let's say the um, um, the the message I want to um, make with this example is to interrupt the energy of spread sometimes, even when you like them. Or um, when you, you don't like them, you just dive in again and make it something you like. Um, it's part of the decision making. I don't think it's a good match because I already have some base idea here. Okay, uh, this could end up not being here. Or maybe yes, like this. But uh, I hope you understand <laughs> the, um, this way of thinking. Um, this is my favorite journal at the moment. I just, uh, for example, glued this yesterday without much thinking. And um, it's still a bit chaotic. I need to calm it down a bit, connect things. So... Um, this is for now how to make uh, this is about how to make uh, collage elements uh, in a different way uh, using old pages interrupting um, um, interrupting spreads that already you worked on and just this is uh, like a, a playground uh, in a book Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.